local, late breaking. This is Channel 2 Action News at 4 p.m. Coverage you can count on. New at four, people are still without power more than two months after Hurricane Maria slammed Puerto Rico. Millions of private donation dollars are heading to the U.S. territory. Channel 2's Dave Huddleston talked with a local man who just returned from all that devastation. We were traveling roads in the mountains, in the central mountains, Puerto Rico, where there was only half of the road. Thomas Kemper, the leader of UMCOR, the disaster relief agency of the United Methodist Church, just returned Saturday from a relief mission to Puerto Rico. That's him in the orange shirt talking with a local man who lost his business. He says Atlanta's winter storm caused a two to three day power outage. Some people in Puerto Rico have been without power for three months. Whole parts of the country are without power, are without water, and how people really struggle to make their living and to continue really living with the aftermath of this uh, terrible hurricane. He shared this video of his trip with me. This home completely cut off because the storm washed away the road. He said Global Ministries donated cleaning supplies for those still reeling from Hurricane Maria. They have started a hot meal program to give to people who have no water and no electricity. And cook and they do uh, over 200 meals three times a week. They've raised five million dollars for relief and rebuilding efforts, more than 11,000 school supplies and almost 50,000 bottles of water. He says in addition to the necessities of life, they also brought with them hope. They also need something that rekindles their spirits, help them to keep their faith, stand up again after you have fallen and, and, and come into the situation. Kimper says some Metro Atlantans may take a week to get back to normal after our winter storm, but it may take some Puerto Ricans years to get back to normal, and that's why his organization will be there to help for the long haul. So people should continue to give to it uh, and, and be in solidarity and, and pray for other people. Reporting from Northeast Atlanta, Dave Huddleston, Channel 2 Action News.